Okay. So here we done today's topic that is area and perimeter. So first of all that I have to explain that what is perimeter. So basically only one thing you have to consider that perimeter that is defined as sum of all side okay okay sum of all side okay before okay. starting that manually i am explaining that what is perimeter okay perimeter that means sum of all sides okay in mm -hmm. any 2d figure okay yes 2d figure yeah. Okay. 2D figure. Do you know what is 2D figure? Yes, yes, I do. Yeah. Means a little bit as usual. You know that 2D figure that means a figure which you can draw on paper. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Yes, yes, yes. Which you can draw on paper. Or you can also understand that 2D figure will be that figure which doesn't contain height. Okay. There will be only length and breadth. Okay. So no width. There will be only length and breadth, no height. Okay. You can okay. ask me a question that, sir. Uh, can I explain that in a little bit more efficiently? So my answer will be yes. How? Because that if you are seeing here, I am drawing a rectangle here okay yeah. okay a b c and d it's a rectangle having length and breadth okay so you are seeing that there is no height that's why it is considered as 2d figure okay oh. on other side the same thing i am writing but that will be a 3d figure just see there yes so now here you can see that i draw the same length and breadth uh, diagram but now here you can see that it is your length okay it is yes. your breadth okay but now here you can see that height is also there okay h clear so that's why it is known as 3d figure okay clear so yeah yes so with a perimeter you have to understand only one thing that if there will be perimeter okay then if miss in any question if in test or your teacher would like to ask you that what is perimeter or any any figures perimeter if they will ask you only you have to think about that okay sir told me that perimeter that is sum of all side simply keep that in your mind okay perimeter that is sum of all side okay Okay. you can understand in this way suppose that if hold on give me a second yeah suppose that uh, yes we we used to say um like a perimeter like the definition for perimeter is the outside distance of an object that's, yeah, that's, a, that's the same thing but here i am explaining in a very convenient way that's why i'm explaining that perimeter sum of all side beta yeah that's the, also the same thing beta okay you suppose okay. that any figure that is given if you would like to sum the surrounding length okay or surrounding distance then you'll get your perimeter okay so here okay. suppose that yeah suppose that uh, what you are are you seeing this one this uh, a b c d here on your left hand yes. side yeah yes, suppose yes. that its length is 10 its breadth is uh, 6 okay okay now most important thing what will be its perimeter so i told you that perimeter equals to sum of all side 
Oh my God! But there is only two side. What we have to do? Um, can you tell me a little bit? You so the ten is at the bottom. So you know that the opposite side of the ten should be ten. Fantastic! And, yes, yes, yes. And then yes, on this dear. side. Understand. Hold on. I understand. Okay, okay. Mita, in a rectangle, as usual, rectangle is a parallelogram. Okay. And we know that according to the common characteristic of parallelogram, opposite side that will also be same. So it will be 10. That means BC is 10. So AD will also 10. Okay. And okay. CD is 10. So AB will also. Sorry, CB is 6. So AB will also be 6. Okay. okay. Now, simple. You have to do one thing. Sir told me sum of all side 10 plus 6 plus 10 plus 6 and then it will be 10 plus 6 16 plus 16 goes to 32 okay centimeter it's your perfect answer okay and we can also do 20 plus 10, which we are also able to do 32 too. Oh yes, that's the same thing. Yeah, that's the same thing. Also, as usually you are seeing, so it is the basic way to understand, okay, about your parameter. Also, you are seeing there is a rectangle, okay? So, perimeter yeah. of rectangle, perimeter of rectangle, rectangle that's the specific formula what the formula is twice of l plus b okay oh yes of course yeah so it is the basic way which you are seeing in parallel color now here is the fundamental means formulated <coughs> formula is here so with the help of formula you can plug in your value wait I had to choose the another color yeah so in your formula you are seeing that yeah suppose that you were a few minutes before there was only length and breadth okay so also you can find its area over there in a very convenient way that is here twice of plug in the values of length that is 10 plus breadth that is 6 and then it will be twice of 16 which will be equals to 32 centimeter now you can see clearly that what answer that you get over here that is also the same as over here clear clear that means we are doing right okay and for area if like if it, yeah if but they are with respect to area yeah yeah we will we will go through uh, area but before that there is also something which you have to understand there <coughs> sorry regarding to your parameter it is the general way to find the parameter any type of figure that will be given if all the sides are given then you have to apply sum of all side and you'll get your parameter also suppose okay. that the parameter okay one other type of question that can also be asked in your test what suppose that they will ask in such a way that the perimeter of rectangle is uh, 20 centimeter okay mm -hmm. yeah oh yes just see that on your screen here perimeter is given 20 centimeter okay, okay. they will ask you that uh, if breadth is if breadth is 4 centimeter, then what will be its length? The length should be 5 centimeters because... Wait, no. No, no, no. It should not be 5 centimeters. Okay. So, Bita, one important thing is that parameter is given. So, that means you have to apply the formula of parameter because they are asking length over there. Okay. So let's see that how we have to solve that. So it will be apply the formula over there.
parameter equals to twice of length plus breadth. Clear? Okay. So, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. And now you can plug in your values. What's that's are given there? That means parameter it will be 20 equals to breadth is given there. That means 2 will be as it is. In place of length, just place L as it is. Plus, in place of breadth, you have to write over there 4. Okay? Oh, wait. Oh, I see. Understand? Yes, yes. I can yes. see the example you put on the board. I mean, yeah. board. Okay. yeah, on a screen, are you able to understand clearly? Yeah. Are, are you seeing clearly on a screen what I'm explaining okay. over here? Yes, on your yes. right hand side, you can see there. So mm -hmm. now you can open your parentheses. Beta, do you understand a little bit uh, about the simplification? of brackets i think yes simplification yeah I me mean, suppose that you have to simplify this one so i think that you, when you open your parenthesis that it will truly really, it will be 12 plus 8 equals to 20. okay, okay? now always okay. remember beta when this type of linear equ equation will be there okay Mm -hmm. Always remember that uh, numeric value will be numeric side and variable value that will be on variable side. That means it will be 20 minus 8 equals to 2L. Okay. Therefore, okay. it will be uh, 12 equals to 2L. Okay. And then L okay. equals to 12 oh. by 2 equals to six centimeters uh, excuse me sir um your page is absolutely blurry um like everything are you able blurry. to see that i uh no it's still blurry like absolutely blurry um whatever like i'm right uh, whatever i'm writing there uh it looks like blurry yes it looks very blurry Beta, I think that yeah. that is a little bit internet problem, but I think on your side, sorry to say, I think that yeah. you'll be able to see that within few seconds, okay, but as usual, I'm also recording your class, so, um, I explained that to you, Beta, now you are able to see that? A screen? Yeah, are you able to see on your screen now? Nope. It's it's a little blurry. Like um, the writing yeah. stuff you did right there, it's like really blurry. Like the words that like like you know were there are also very blurry. I can send you a picture. Like no, 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 you don't have to see. You don't have to send picture, but I understand that. I understand that. Okay. So wait. So I explained over here, beta. When you see your video, then you will understand clearly how I get it, okay? With the help of okay. formula that I get it here. Okay, tell me one thing. Are you able to see my paint screen over here? No. Just I opened that one. It's stuck in blur, actually. Um, okay. Wait. I will means regarding to oh, this. Now, yeah. Now, yeah. Now, now it's better. Yeah. Now you're able to see now clearly. Now is good. No more stuff. <clears throat> yes. Now, now I'm able to see clearly. Oh yes. Thank God. Okay. So, beta, you can see here. You can see here that uh, are you able to see this last example which I explained that to you? Parameter yeah. that is twenty. Breadth that is given for they are asking about length. You have to apply your parameter formula. So parameter formula which you are seeing on your screen that is parameter of rectangle that is your twice of length plus breadth. Okay. Now whatever values are given you have to plug in there. 
perimeter is again 20 centimeters so you are plugging here 20 okay don't write centimeter over there because now you are plugging the values so while plugging values we don't have to write their unit okay yes Wait, it's we don't a, have to write. yes we don't have to write unit oh, yes um that's why um, that you actually, are actually i'm sorry for you but like uh we're actually actually lanes plus wood like like i hello yeah i'm here i'm here okay oh now you're people learning again i know okay no not good yeah uh, we're not really learning about links plus breath we're actually learning about links plus width one i mean we're learning about links times width for area and for perimeter we're doing links plus links plus width plus width we're not doing breath yes yes you can also do in the same way you can also do suppose that here we are using formula okay so you can also do suppose that what basic i explained that to you okay suppose that uh, at uh, test time that you forget your formula okay then what you will do now so you can do one thing just you have to write that out oh, oh my god give me a second give me a second do i raise over here whatever i explained lastly okay. do do I erase what I explained over here lastly? Uh, yes. yes. Yes, yes, yes. When you'll see your video, then that will be there. <laughs> okay. So wait yeah. a second. I'm going, yeah, I'm erasing that bit quickly so that uh, it will be much convenient for me to explain the next way of finding your length over there. So question, in question, as usual, you are seeing that there is there is parameter given breadth given length they are asking so fundamentally okay then suppose that you forget you forget your formula in your test okay then what will you do then simply you have to understand that sir told me that wait a second it's a very light color so you have to think about that sir told me that parameter equals to sum of all side okay so that means yeah. length plus four that is breadth plus mm -hmm. again length plus four do you understand it yes because like you're adding all the sides yes together, like, because fundamentally i told you that parameter is sum of all side okay now beta here you mm -hmm. can see that there are two l L plus L, it will be 2L plus 4 plus 4, that will be 8. Okay? Mm -hmm. Understand? And uh, yeah, is. here, parameter that is given also 20 centimeter. Okay? Now, very clearly, you have to remember that when you will write, when you will plug in your values, always remember that. Uh, number will transfer on number side okay and variable means numbers will be on one side and variable will be on other side okay that's why that i will transfer it from right hand side to left hand side okay that means it will be 20 minus 8 it will be and always remember when you will transfer your number on other side then it will change its sign okay it will change its sign that means here you are seeing that it is plus eight when i will transfer here then it will be minus eight okay so 20 wait, why, pardon? why wait why is it 20 minus eight instead of 20 plus eight beta that's why i am seeing you that's why i'm telling you that when it's a, it's a rule that when you will transfer any number here you are seeing that it is it is in addition okay it is in addition on right hand side when you will transfer a number eight on other side that means on left hand side then it will be negative okay it will subtract okay 
So 20, oh. yeah, 20 minus 8 equals to 12 will be here. And then it will be 12 here. 12 equals to 12. And then, therefore, wait, hold on. I change in color. Then 12. And now you can see that 12, 12 equals to 12. Or you can also write that in this way, like 12 equals to 12. Okay. And then L equals to 12 by 2. Okay. And then again, you have to reduce that. When you reduce, then 2 ones are 2, 2 6 are 12, and you'll get 6 as your length. Okay? I see now. Are you able to see? They say that they are 2. But before it was so confusing, now I'm starting to get it. Uh, what you are not understanding over here. I understand, like, like what I meant when I said I, I was starting to was like, it was, it was like making more sense. Cause like before it was sort of getting a bit weird, and then now it's making more sense. Oh, okay, okay, thank God, that's great. Yes, Vita. So I explained here the depth of perimeter. Only two way to solve perimeter. If all the sides are given, so simply you will be able to solve first first way is this one first one okay here and the second way that by applying your formula okay perimeter if let if their uh, means uh, dimensions are given that means length breadth that is given okay suppose that if regarding to perimeter two quantities are given means perimeter and breadth or suppose perimeter or length so also one process or one method was that you can apply your formula plug in your value and simplify that okay the other way is that what you are seeing the second way over here okay first first way that i explained that to you just before erasing that okay so now you understand clearly mm -hmm. sir i have a question um yes this uh this perimeter thing because actually i was sh i was just seeing about like perimeter stuff although i i am an a plus person for area and perimeter um it's just that is is this length plus breadth or whatever it is going to be on my test like when you give me a test i think uh, you are in f you are in fourth grade yes uh I am explaining in advance, so let me check that what type of question will be there with respect to parameter. I am going to refresh that one so that, uh, yeah, I am going to refresh so it will, this page will come and come again. Uh, yeah, again, are you able to see on your screen now? It is, yes, yes, I am able Great. to see. So you are in fourth grade, dear. I'm changing your grade. Give me a oh. second. Uh, How did you go? Pardon? It says middle school. Yeah, I'm changing it. Oh. oh. Great, great, great. Give me a second. Um. Equation, sequence, graph. Measurement, let me check that. Is there um weight? Unit of capacity, measurement, parameter. Oh my god. Great. So now regarding to your grade, yeah, that was the basic knowledge. Okay. Now let's see that what is given over here, okay parameter so here will be the question regarding to your grade okay so it is coming on your screen are you able to see on your screen yes yes great great yes, in yes. so here this type of question that will be given so if you want to add if you want to understand parameter so here you can see that uh, 
there are a number of blocks which are combined together over here. So simply, if you will get graded figure over there, so you just have to find firstly all the edges, okay, means all the dimension. So here you are seeing that one means regarding to length. Can you tell me that what will be the length over here? Length. The length should be six because it says. Yeah, so yeah, yes, yes, yes. Great. It is. It contains a six blocks over here regarding to length, and four blocks are here regarding to breadth. So that means its dimension will be length that is six and breadth that will be four. So can you tell me before clicking next what will be its perimeter? The perimeter should be twenty. Oh, fantastic! Wow, that's great. Okay, I'm clicking over there and let's see that what the computer is assigning here. Are you able to see? Yeah, I'm able to see. Did you understand? Right. Did you understand? Mm -hmm. Yes, I totally understand. Okay, just see again. Here, parameter, as I explained that to you, the total length around the edge of a shape okay or sum mm -hmm. of all side of any 2d figure i explained you a standard definition okay yes so okay again i am doing that just to try we have to find the parameter so after getting length 6 breadth 4 length 6 breadth 4 and total 20 that's great now you understand clearly mm -hmm. Great. A quickest, quicker way to do this, that is, you can do twice of length, okay, and mm -hmm. that then you'll get 12 centimeter. Again, you can do twice of breadth, then you'll get 8 yeah. centimeter, and then you have to add both that's, of them. That's, that's what I did. Yes. So that's and then you'll get the same answer. Okay. Do you understand that? Yes, yes, I definitely do. Great. Next. Now tell me quickly what will be the parameter of this figure which you are seeing on your screen. 18. Okay. 18. That's right. Great. What will be the parameter over here? 16. Good. One more. Wow. Now tell me what will be the parameter over here. Beta, simply you have to understand that you have to add all the sides. That's it. Okay? Oh, we can do. Wait, so I only have to add, not to like. Yes, you can ask me. Have, yes. Because I'm. If, it, if the two rectangles sometimes, like if, if it says seven and two, and the length was seven and the width was two, so like, does it mean that I, because like sometimes that you know that like the opposite of, like the top of seven should be uh, seven two, and the opposite of two should be two, so do, do I have to keep on like adding more over here, or, or do I have to add five, four, three, two, two? Five, four, three, two, two. But what about here? The top. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You have Wait. to. Wait. Yeah. It should be two. Yes, 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 yes. That's right. Oh. Yes. What I mean to say, suppose that this type of figure will be given to you in your test. So they are will ask you that what will be the parameter. So you can uh, understand there. Okay, suppose that here is 2. Okay, suppose that if your figure is not graded. Okay, so you can see that here is 2. Are you able to see my moving cursor? Yes, yes, yes. Great. So here, here downwards you can see that the total that is 4. Okay, but a little bit top here you can see that it is 2. Okay, mm. then what will be over here? So it will also be 2. Okay. Yes, yes, I understand. Yes, so when you'll get your uh, this length or miss, yeah, simple, this distance or this length, and yes, that you can understand, 
in any way so then you will be able to get your parameter so now you can tell me that what will be your parameter one minute yeah i'm waiting uh answer should be 18. okay you are telling me 18. are you sure about that great fantastic it's right so one more wait wait, wait, wait oh. hold on Sorry. you go on oh yeah okay okay yeah you can you can ask me a question what do you want to ask to me it was about the previous question okay I was... okay hold on hold on wait a second bitte wait a second bitte. don't worry don't worry i'm clicking over again okay i'm clicking again okay so very quickly five four nine nine is eighteen will be here great next it will be six to eight it to the sixteen will be here and then yep and then yeah now we are here again yes so i just check that you said the like i said the answer was 18 remember yes yeah okay so i just wanted to make sure and what i did was i wait a minute okay dear just see on your screen okay i'm explaining that and then you have to understand that either you did right or not okay you are seeing that this length that you know about okay as i explained that to you that parameter that is sum of yeah parameter that is sum of all side okay so in yeah. this figure that this length that you know that this length of figure this length also you know that it is four this length that is three you are seeing here okay and with respect to two. and here yeah here you are seeing that it is your two okay it is also given to oh but here two is not given what will be here so you just have to understand because that, yes wait. because downwards the total that is from here to here that is four okay yeah. but a little bit you can see that if you would and here it is your two okay it is your two so what okay. will be what will be here that should be two because yeah. Two uh, that should be two, two yeah four. that should be two because if you would like to see if you would like to see this rectangle okay which i am shading here okay okay i still understand yeah. wait wait if, if what i just did was i counted all the squares and if you count it one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen six oh Wait, you didn't give an answer of 16. I'm getting like absolutely confused. So, beta, uh, but now you are understanding clearly? Oh! Because you can understand that it is given 2 cm and the total is 4 cm. Now, clearly, you understand that it will be 2 oh. cm, okay? And when it will be 2 cm, so you can understand that your upward length that will also be 2 cm, okay? okay. Clear? Um, sir, if you mind, yes, yes, let's go. If you mind, can, can I go to the back? Just like where? Um, pardon? Please. Uh, actually, your voice is not coming. Okay, okay. You want you want to take time a little bit? Yeah, so, sort of. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, please take your time. I am waiting. I am waiting. Please.
I'm so sorry about that. No, 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 please, please, don't mind of that, beta. Don't mind. It's a common thing. So, beta, do you understand now that uh, how we are getting that uh, your uh, unknown length over here? So, you can yeah. see that, yes, when you will, if, if you will imagine this rectangle, so in rectangle it is your 4, so the opposite side that should also be 4, but you can see that only 2 cm that is here, so the remaining that will be 2 cm. So if it if here you can see that, now you can imagine your next figure over here, wait, 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 wait. hold on, by next color, yeah, here. Now you can see that it is your square over here, okay, it's your square, yes, this one which I am shading as blue, yes, so it will be, it will be, <coughs> sorry it is your square so it will be two centimeters so the other opposite side that will also be two centimeter okay okay yes yes I and when it. when you'll get two centimeter so simply you have to do that uh, yeah now i'm getting parameters so that means you have to write that five centimeter plus four centimeter plus three centimeter plus 2 cm plus 2 cm plus 2 cm 1, 2, 3 I think yes 1, 2, 3, yes. 4, 5, 6 yes so 5, 4, 9 9, 3 <clears throat> 12 to 14 to 16 and to 18 so overall you will get 18 cm that will be your parameter do you understand clearly? yes sir let me just uh draw this out so i can remember it when i study my notes so what do you want to do no i i'm just drawing the picture so i know the example but uh, I, I can i can take a screenshot i'll send it to you yeah i can send it to you so don't worry oh, you okay. don't have to write that you don't have to draw that okay. yeah give me one second give me okay. one second i'm sending it to you very quickly <clears throat> i just did it yeah, no problem, no problem, but, eh? yeah, it's here, you don't have to draw that, so, as usual, this picture is also there on your Skype ID, and also, your video will be, within few hours, it will be live on my channel, okay, do you know about my channel, Skype Online Tuition, I had uploaded off your previous class, did you saw that? Skype Online what? Tuition? Yeah, Skype online tuition. That's my YouTube channel. Skype online tuition. Yes. Okay. So you can go there and you can see your classes after my class. Okay. Within few hours, I will upload that. Whatever I am explaining over here, parameter, you will be able to see all that as it is. Okay. There. Okay. So okay. now. One more important thing that I'm refreshing again, beta. I'm refreshing again, and uh, let it is coming on your screen again. 
and yes, after yes. a second I explain that yes so here that different figures that will be there it's a rectangle oh no 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 we don't have to do that we suppose that this type of figure will be given and they will ask you that to measure the length and breadth and then you can find your parameter okay so a uh, little okay. bit that uh, I can do here very quickly for that I think it is three here okay mm. three three will be your breadth okay and hold on give me one second I am yes three will be breadth and uh, I think uh, four yeah four. four will be your length okay so four three seven and seven to the 14 okay do you understand that yes yes so side yeah side one that will be you can write over here yeah this is working I think that you understand that I don't think that I have to plug in values over here yeah, side one. yeah. so 14 when will mark it yeah that's right okay again it is your triangle so here you are seeing that a triangle with the help of your scale Firstly, you have to measure it. It's a side, one side over here. It is three it centimeter. Is okay. Of seeing this picture, you can understand clearly. It is a type of equilateral triangle. Okay. Beta, mm -hmm. do you know about what is equilateral triangle? No, I do not. Know. I am telling Wait, you. Equilateral. Equilateral. That is. Which oh, oh, yes, 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 yeah, yes, all yes. the sides equal. Okay, so as usual, you are seeing that one side that is three centimeter. Okay, so now you have to do that three plus three plus three, then it'll be nine centimeter. Okay, so that will be your parameter. Understand? Yes, I understand. Yes, it's a C that is your parallelogram. Yeah, so parallelogram. Firstly, you have to measure your one one length. Okay. Length is your no, 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 it is not five, it is a 4.7. Okay, oh. yeah, it is your 4.7, and now side two that will also be 4.7, and then a little bit. I have to short scale, give me a second, and then we can rotate it. Yes, a little bit. And then we can place over here a little bit also I have to give me a second and one second yes and again it is approximately 3.1 okay you can see here 3.1 okay yeah. so it will be 3.1 3.1 and the other one will also be 3.1 okay beta you are seeing parallelogram here okay always remember that in parallelogram opposite sides will be equal and parallel okay yeah. equal that you are understanding parallel that means they will have same distance okay or equal distance with respect to all the points on that on those line okay that is your mm -hmm. parallel condition so that means it will be now you can add that quickly so 7 7 14 15 16 it will be 6 here and 4 4 8 8 6 14 and uh, 1 15 so 15.6 centimeter point 0.6 15.6 centimeter now they are asking that what will be your answer in millimeter one centimeter equals to 10 millimeter okay mm -hmm. so then it will be uh, 156 okay oh. Oh. so maybe it's just like a centimeter thing but like you just have to remove the dot yeah you yeah you, yeah, you oh. just have to remove the dot it's a trick but the fundamental fact is one centimeter equals to 10 millimeter that means you have to multiply your centimeter by 10 to convert that in millimeter okay okay and when you will mark it oops what hold on give me a second um 
You know what I'm thinking? Maybe it says try again because maybe I really no, don't think no, no, no. Actually, they are saying try again, but I am doing right. 3.1 is here. Hold on. Yeah, you can also oh. see that, beta. You can also see that. Why should it will? It is wrong. Give me one second. No, maybe, maybe it's not asking for like 15.6, like the point. Because like before, other ones um, wasn't working. 14. Do that. 14.7, 14.7. I think if 15.6, so I think you can also take that uh, like 16, a round off. Give me one second. 16 centimeter. Or now it will be in round off 160 millimeter. Let me try this one. No, it is also not coming. Hmm. How about. How about try 14 in the centimeter box? Because that adds up all the sides. But then, why, like, but, uh, but why you are taking 14 centimeter? Cause wait, but it's perimeter, so like one side was like four, the other side was three, so like four plus four plus eight. <coughs> Meta, wait a second. If you will see on a scale, you are seeing that it is 4.7. Okay. I don't know how to point yet. I don't yeah. know how to point. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I am also not understanding that why computer because it's a computerized, it's a computerized online uh, book. So I am not understanding why they are giving here 4.5 is here six seven. That's right. 4.7. Wait, let me check. Seven seven fourteen fifteen sixteen. There will be six. And one is here, four four eight, eight three, eight three eleven, eleven three, fourteen and one fifteen. But fifteen point six, um, fifteen point six. Hold on, I'm plugging again. Fifteen point six. Sorry, six, and it'll be. 156 I don't know that why uh, it is getting wrong beta because it will add 4.7 4.7 3.1 3.1 with the help of calculator in my phone I'm checking that again give me one second give me one second only one second Okay, no, no, it's, it's okay. Give me one second. I'm checking very quickly. 4.7 plus 4.7 plus that was 3.1, 3, 3.1 plus 3.1. Yeah, that's the same. 15.6 centimeter. Hmm. Oh, then okay, then leave, that, leave that beta. We don't uh, actually that you yeah. are understanding that I am doing right. I'm also understanding that I am doing right, but I don't know that why it is getting wrong. Yeah, yeah. yeah. so okay. we can leave this. One. I have, I have one question before like we move on something. Can you like send me uh like what what your YouTube channel is called? Oh yes, beta. Yes, you can. Okay, I'm showing you. Give me one second before doing that. Um. You just have to go to YouTube over here. YouTube. Yeah. Let me open my YouTube so I can try. I'll open my YouTube. Yes, channel. I'm showing you how will you go there. When you will come here, YouTube. Okay. When you'll come over here, YouTube. So then you have to type Skype, S K Y P E, Skype online tuition. Okay. Oh, okay, hold on, let yeah. me do that right now, hold on. Let me do that. I find you, hold on. Sky on one tuition. Yeah. Um, where basically are you? Oh, wait, I think I found you. Yes, here is a girl yeah. with a laptop. Yeah, it says... Yeah, yes, I can see. It you says just have, introduction. Yeah, yeah okay. just just you had to open that, click there. Now you 
have to i think that there will be a subscribe button okay and you will go yes my video is there here my introductory video and then here these are the classes okay i don't see it it only yeah. says introduction. It doesn't say anything else. It just says no, 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 no. You just see that on your okay. screen. Here you are seeing that. Home, that is your introduction. Okay. okay. When you will click on home, then here is my introduction. Here you can see that introduction by Professor Rajiv Tripathi. Hello, friends. Okay. Myself, Rajiv and, Tripathi. I'm and then here, when you will click on videos, okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, just uh, if you didn't subscribe, you can subscribe there, okay? Okay. Yes, just subscribe and then you'll be able to see all the videos. Are okay, you I, I also pressed the little notification thing so, so that I would get like notification from you. So. Do, you do you subscribe that? Yes, yes, I did too. Yes, so I think that now you can go to video. Okay, so when you go to video, you can see on your screen that you are seeing that here all the videos that are here, you know? Yes, mm -hmm. percentage trick, okay, preparing and drafting, okay, mole concept. That means there are very few topics related to means you. I think that a parameter will also be there, okay? Give me a second, parameter. Yes, multiple and divisibility, multiple, yes, 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 Miss Bita, simplification, multiplication, and all that, wait, uh, parameter, give me one second, parameter that with respect to other students also, yeah, here, you can see that, Bita, there is also a video of parameter over here, okay, expecting oh. of your video, yeah your class video there is also parameter over here so in here you can go to this video and you can also understand there okay that will be much convenient for you to understand that okay so also yeah. different things you can see that parameter area of circle concept of means i think that area of circle yes fourth fifth i think it if that will be in your course then you can go to this a uh, video you can see area of circle then concept of parallel lines exterior angle interior angle okay next again you can move over there yeah these are of your miss these are for you exterior and interior angles simplification modeling okay modeling mm -hmm. too okay these okay. are with respect to you yes Understand, so, understanding so. ratio ratio to area of trapezium okay like so this where were, like, so like where were like the first video like the thing on sunday that you said you updated i mean posted yeah your class will update within few hours your this class which you are seeing here it will be up, up. like the other sunday class the the next the other sunday class last sunday class your previous sorry give me a second your previous class i think no, no 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 i didn't upload that one because that i was asking to you a little bit that's why i didn't upload that one beta but your today's class will be uploaded within few hours okay okay yes check tomorrow yes yes, yes. when, when you get up when you'll get up early in the morning then you can check that your class will be there and the topic will again parameter okay Mm -hmm. Yes, parameter topic you can also see there as as you are seeing that one parameter topic is over here. So I would mm -hmm. like to write that in capital letters. Okay, whole caps lock on. Okay, so but uh, I think uh, the time is getting. Do you understand that? Did you saw my yes. channel? Yes, yes, yes. So in that condition, but, uh, every time you can move to your channel and you can you can see all of the videos. Are related to mathematics also there are a few videos related to english also okay yes, okay, yes. In english and math that will be convenient for you to see that okay and if there will be any problem of seeing any video if there will be any question related to that you can ask to me anytime okay yeah. yes okay. so now come to again your next uh, wait yeah here you can see that beta 
I think that one question that we can do over here very quickly. You are seeing that this one here is nine, so it mm -hmm. here it, it is a regular hexagon. Why it is? A, how much it will be? Nine. I mean no, like like all the sides are nine. So, oh oops, I closed my book. Hold on, let me go yeah, back. Okay, okay. okay. Do, do that quickly. Yes. <laughs> So it's nine times six. I mean, no, no. Yes, wait, wait, hold on. It's a regular hexagon. That, how much? Fifty-four. Fantastic, your answer is right. So next, you are seeing that it is your equilateral triangle. They are saying that its a perimeter is thirty-three. So what will be each length? Oh, 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 it's 11, 11, and 11. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Yes, you are right. You are right. You are very clever child. Wow. That's great. Beta. Fantastic. Keep it on. Very good. Yes. Okay. So, here you can see that three sided are there of equal length. So, suppose that one length will be x, 3x equals to 33. So, x will be 11. So, that means each side that will be 11 over there. Now, the last one over here. You can see that the perimeter of rectangle, okay, that they are given 26 and they are asking that what will be its breadth? Yes, it should be 15. Uh, but why? Wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Beta, perimeter that is given 26 and length is given 11 and they yes. are asking breadth. Yeah, so the breadth should be 15. But why are you saying 15? It is 11, so the other side will also be 11. Okay. So 22, that will be total length. So 22, you have to subtract from 26, then you will get 4 there. Okay. Wait, wait, no. The top one is supposed to be 3, because 11 plus 11 equals 22. So no, no, no. Better 20, better 26, that is perimeter, not side. You can see here, it's a perimeter. Clear? Oh. It's a um, perimeter. Perimeter is given 26 and length is given 11. So what will be its breadth? Two. Yes, you are right. Fantastic. I'm going to mark it. Give me one second. Three, two, one, not. Yay, that's right. <laughs> Your all the questions are right. Fantastic. So, beta, uh, with respect to separate miss parameter, I explained that to you very, very conveniently. Okay. Do you understand all that clearly? Yes, of course. I, I, I understand also. Yes. And one last thing, beta. Here you are seeing regular word. Okay. Regular hexagon. Regular word will be used only when the sides that will be equal and angles with respect to that will also equal okay regular hexagon that means all the sides and their corresponding angles will be same okay oh yes so beta uh, okay thanks for today have a great time i hope you enjoyed today's class beta within few hours you will yes. be miss, miss suppose that on your side that there is seven o'clock okay we, uh, maybe if you would like to see that at nine o'clock okay at as per your mm -hmm. time then it's, you can see your video okay on my channel yeah yeah topic, and, uh, video, and yeah, topic will be in uh, capital uh, letter in capital letter or simply that a uh, latest video you can see if you will see latest video then parameter there is a topic parameter okay so it may be possible that i would like to uh, write their parameter okay <laughs> 100% yeah. you will you will search you have to search your uh, video and you will get your class video okay yeah. so thanks for